Well, just a few days left before the Olympic Winter Games in Sochi wrap up, and right now, Team USA stands at the top of the medal count. The closing ceremonies set for Sunday. A spoiler alert there for you this afternoon. The biggest events today, the men's hockey, Team USA taking on Canada, along with alpine skiing and curling. ABC's Jim Ryan has a wrap-up of today's events. Making Olympic history again for Team USA, this time by Alpine skier Michaela Schifrin, whose gold medal in slalom makes her the youngest Olympic champion in that sport, male or female, ever. A near flawless first run had her in first place entering her second, and despite a stumble midway through that run, she finished more than half a second faster than Austrian Marlies Schild, one of Schifrin's childhood role models. It looks as though a couple of cases of White House brew will be headed across the northern border, President Obama having to pay up on his bet with Prime Minister Stephen Harper. In face-offs between the two North American powerhouses, Canada again came out ahead. In today's tight semifinal, Jamie Benn's second period goal was the only score, but that's all Canada needed to beat Team USA. Canada now plays for gold against Sweden on Sunday. The U.S. left to hope for a bronze in a battle with Finland tomorrow. Yesterday, the Canadian women continued their gold streak, topping their American rivals, the 3-2 win coming in overtime. Despite the heartbreaking loss, there is some consolation for hockey forward Julie Chu. She's been selected to carry the U.S. flag during the closing ceremony. Chu, who's been with Team USA since the 2002 Salt Lake City Games, is a four-time Olympian with three silvers and a bronze. After learning she had been chosen, Chu said she is completely humbled and kind of in shock. And finally, a four-member team of Americans ended the medal drought for U.S. speed skaters, winning a silver in the 5,000-meter relay. The Russian team in first with the gold. Jim Ryan, ABC News, Sochi, Russia. And amid the turmoil in Kiev with protests continuing there, Ukrainian athletes won their first gold medal today. They captured the gold in the women's biathlon relay, defeating Russia and Norway.